We say thank you, I say thank you, you say thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Hey guys. Um, as I said with the mask, uh, this is a thank you video because today I have just reached. 10 subscribers for my channel, and I want to say thank you to all 10 of you who have subscribed, and I hope that you have keep subscribed, possibly if I ever hit the milestone, 1 million, or a thousand, or 100, or 1,000. Truthfully, I'm happy just to have 10, or anything, because when I started my channel, uh, I did not expect to even get one subscriber, or anything. So, thank you very much for subscribing and bearing with me through... All my insanity, especially with uh, these guys. So, again, one more time, thank you. And, um, trying to get with this video is really, and besides the thank you for 10,000, wait, 10,000, <clears throat> going ahead of myself, 10 subscribers, thank you. Um, if you haven't heard, if you haven't heard the show, what would you do? Um, from what I'm getting the impression of, it takes these horrible situations, sees what people would do when they're just a bystander. What I saw was a someone introducing his girlfriend to his parents. The woman is large. I got no problem with that. So what? She's big. But the response the parents give is completely disrespectful and un just wrong as all hell they say they were expecting someone different that his past girlfriends had been in shape fit thin the fa they both walk out of this meeting just shaming this woman for being big What the fuck is wrong with you? This scenario has met people doing what should be done and burning these people to the ground verbally. One man, the first guy says, shut up, you're being rude. The woman has the, the, the guts to say she's not being rude after fat shaming this woman. She says, look at her. I know this was. Yep, look at you. Shut up. Go with your husband. What reason is there to fat shame someone just because they don't look like you? Another thing is that the father said she was unhealthy. Look, just because you're big doesn't mean you are unhealthy. Yes, you have. Yes, big people eat a lot more. I'm not trying to do this, okay? But just because they're big. Doesn't mean they don't try and stay healthy. This is such a topic for me since as a kid I was big and I was bullied for the size I was and no one truly came to help me. So I had to grow a spine and toughen up. Another woman, another thing is that when this couple leaves, the father has the balls to say, make sure she doesn't grab any donuts off the counter. What is wrong with you? I mean, really, what did he do wrong in life to make him think this way? Then the mother, ha then this woman who bum just goes crazy with these people. Which I completely agree with. The mom has the nerve to say, we taught him, and gets cut off.
What the? Have you been teaching him? How do we shallow? How do we only care about people's appearance? I hate shit body shape. I hate any of that kind of crap. There's no reason for it. Just because someone does not look like does not give you the excuse to be tr be raped. To Hold on. Leo, get up. <sighs> I'm saying, this woman doesn't look the same size as you, doesn't look like you, doesn't... <clears throat> <sighs> it's almost 10 where I am. <sighs> what have you been teaching your son? And the father thinks that her habits will rub off on him. You have no information about this woman other than what you've seen and what you've judged and what you've labeled. You have no information of how she lives her life. You have no idea. How she lives, how she acts. You don't know if she's active or not. You just see her. You just see a big body and you think, oh, she's unhealthy and fat, just fat. If I was in that restaurant, I would have snapped like that on these people. There is never a good reason and there is never a reason to body shame anyone because they don't deserve it it's people like you that cause this the shamers cause it they cause people to get these problems they cause people to find the solution in death they're the reason people kill themselves shamers are the reason for suicide Bullies, shamers, they're the people who make suicide. So please, to the 10 people, and hopefully the people who will continue to watch me and be introduced to me, make sure you're not one of these people. You're not a bully. You're not a shamer. Nothing good comes from shaming someone. I should know. I cannot count how many times as a little kid I committed, I have considered killing myself because of what people said about me. How I act, how I look, how I dress. Then I grew something that affords me to where it helps me. I grew this. Claws. I grew claws. I grew rough. I grew tough. I grew a spine. And I learned. Who berate me, who label me, who shamed me as a kid. I learned that they're just fueling a fire that will never go out. If you see this happen, don't just stand and ignore it. Help, because you may help me pass it on. Help people grow the claws of, of truth. Help people see that it's absolute what other people think. It's obsolete of the opinions of others. The only opinion that matters is yours.
your opinion is the one that matters. It does not matter what people think. It does not matter what others think. It only matters what you think. Please, to all of you who have these problems, do not let them win. Do not let them get in your head. Do not let them think that you're lesser than them. For them doing this, they're proving that you are better than them. That makes sense to me because I'm probably crazy. It proves you're better because you're not a person who would do this, are you? You would not. Someone who is shamed would never shame someone else. I'll make this short. I'll make it simple. If you meet someone who is shamed or is a shamer, help those who are shamed. Ignore those who are shamed. label, they verbally abuse, and they try to put down those who are not like them. It is not right. It is never right. It is not deserved. It is not justified ever. With every reason you're making, you are not the innocent. Just a sheep. Don't let people bring you down to their level. Rise like the bird of war. Make sure they know you are stronger than them. Okay, enough about the lesson. Again, I just want to say thank you all for 10 subscribers, and hopefully I can make another one of these at 20. So I'm going to close this video by saying, once again, one more time, thank you for 10 subscribers and please fight for your right to be you do not let people put you down do not let people drag you down let that negativity let that hatred toward you burn the fire within your soul to fight to throw them wrong to make them see Dang.